other than looking like a thief. What are you doing? Nothing much. Just gilling my spots for hall to ear. Dud or do youing, wumass. Hope, can you interpret this for me? It seems to me like it's some kind of code or cipher, but I don't have enough data yet to break it. Can't you speak normally? Show nit. <sighs> of course I can. Look, I don't have any info about any treasure, if that's what you're looking for. I've got no interest in it. Boo fed to you. Doesn't seem like many people choose to live out here unless they're after treasure. So, what's your story? Leave be, Lee. The world's going to end soon anyway, right? If that's the case, what's the point in having dreams or working hard? So, sitting around waiting for the end was the best idea you could come up with. Nice way to spend your last days. Well, yeah, it's boring, but nothing I do now makes any sort of difference anyway, so why bother? <sighs> no matter how much I might unravel mysteries of the past, none of these bandits care. They don't even listen to my findings. <sighs> Tro wouldn't even nice to understand. I get that it's hard to stay motivated when no one appreciates what you do. I'd say so. If you get it, why are you giving me a hard time? Just leave me alone. I'm done with all of it. <sighs> I ditched all my equipment in the desert. If you find any of my old things, they're yours. Take them away with you. I think I may just do that. They deserve better than getting tossed aside by some sulking, spoiled kid. Take them, Ten. It's a big desert, you know. Do you really expect to find his things out there in the middle of nowhere? What is it? Don't tell me you actually found something. Is this it? What you threw away? Uh, how did you... Dad's loop? Dad? Never mind that. Just give it back to me. Now! You want it back? Who was it that told me I was welcome to whatever I could find? I'm not sure I want to give it up. <sighs> Fine. I'll talk if I have to. My dad was a great bandit, okay? But he was also a great appraiser. He spent his whole life studying the relics in these ruins. So he wanted you to follow in his footsteps? No, it wasn't like that. Not at all. He taught me everything he knew so that I could become a scholar. He wanted me to be able to unravel the mysteries of the past. But then he disappeared. Never made it home. No one ever found any clue as to what happened. He left me and took my only chance at becoming a scholar with him. Didn't have much choice. I could appraise or starve. Is that why you threw away his tools? In order to spite your father? It was stupid. I was stupid. I should have just done what my dad wanted and kept working to be a real scholar. But he's gone, and it's too late now. This world is nearly done for. But if I'm ever reborn, I promise I'll take things a bit more seriously. I'll give it my all. I'll study hard, and I'll become a great scholar and solve all kinds of mysteries. Maybe that's too much to ask for. You should dream big, and the first step to making your dream come true is believing it can come true. <laughs> 